Barnet won, Notts County won. Dean, your thoughts on that performance? Yeah, um, they ask a lot of questions of you, Notts County. They're Man City-esque. Um, they're one of them teams, they're so well coached. Um, and they play with so much wit and ask so many questions of you defensively. Um, but I just felt forced half. We didn't make enough contacts in their half. Our back line was too deep. And I uh, just spoke about at half time, making more contacts in their half, being more physical with them. So we could play our game as well. So we've got good runners, good athleticism. And I thought in the end, we some fantastic chances to win the game. Laurie's had to make a couple of saves as well. So all in all, a good advert for the division. You mentioned about that first half. We defended really well. How important was it to get that goal right in the cusp at half time? Yeah, that helped. Uh, obviously, the throw in's a weapon, isn't it? You know, it's a great asset to us. Um, interested well to get it, uh, to get the to get the throw in down that side, um, and then yeah, it was a great time to score. Um, so for us, yeah, it gave us a boost. And it allowed us then to get in a half time and sort of settle the team down. So we we changed things tactically at half time, and then we had to change again because they changed tactically. They went with Dime in the midfield. Uh, we're in there three sort of. Uh, with the three at the back and then Diamond in the midfield and then they have the width on both sides so we changed again to a different system again to counter that and I thought that worked really well. When we went up to Notts County earlier in this a uh, couple of weeks ago it was like going into a gunfight with baseball bats um, and today we've gone into a gunfight with guns so we've been able to cope with it because um, we've got some players back and um, it's great to have Dom Revan back. I thought Pauli did a great job for the team for the players and played a lot this year um, so we just want to get all our players back and the sooner that happens um, I think the better performances will be and the better results will be. You mentioned about injuries in that first half we saw Laurie go down holding the top of his shoulder is is he all right? Yeah he's got through for us today we've a week off now to our next game that's so important I think for the last seven weeks we've been on the road haven't we? Yeah so uh, midweek I'm on about um, so we've got a lot of games in a short space of time so it'll be nice now to, before we go back on the road again and we've got some mammoth journeys coming up to have a week, you know, to prepare for the next game. Notts County, I mean, them and Wrexham, incredible seasons this year. That second half, we created so many chances against them. How much of a positive that is that? Always good to create chances. Um, created lots of chances during the night. Created lots of chances against Yeovil. Created lots of chances against Altrigan. Didn't manage to win that game. It's just so important we get a consistent uh, 11 out as much as we can, especially defensively. Every good team's built on a solid defence, and ours has been up and down all season. We're hoping Winter's back next week, we're hoping Collins is back for next week. They're massive players for us, so the sooner they're all back, the better. A uh, big point, the talking point of that second half, it appeared that uh, Courtney Senior was pushed in the Notts County box. Did you see much of that? It's a penalty. It's just like a trip, isn't it? He skipped by the lad. And from our from air angle, it's a penalty. Uh, I don't think he's ever going to be strong enough to give that. Um, for Roy, he's a young referee, isn't he? I don't, I don't think he's done a lot of games at our level, um, which is a bit interesting for such a big game. But then, first half, could not County have had a penalty. Laurie claims he got the ball when I spoke to him at half time, so I don't know. Um, this is a hard job being a referee, I wouldn't do it, I'll tell you that now. This is our first week in quite some time that we've got no midweek game, full week to prepare for a derby game against Wealdstone. How will we utilise that week? Massive, uh, some recovery, a lot of the players have played a lot of minutes, so we'll have different groups. Um, Monday, Tuesday, the lads that haven't been playing work extremely hard. And then we'll bring the, we'll have Wednesday off, we'll bring the groups together on Thursday, Friday. Uh, Pritchard's played every minute of every game. So it was good to have Gorman back as well, that was another thing that was good positive. Um, like I say, um, the sooner we can get our strongest 11 out, the better, especially going into this running, because every point, every goal, everything's going to matter. Dean, thank you for your time. Cheers, thanks.